Hey guys, Dan Hood, Big DH2000 here. Just finished up another one. Had this one going for quite some time, but then kind of put it on pause. Um, you'll remember I made one for Darren Cook some time back. Well, I made two at the same time. Um, he took his slightly different, and this one I kind of finished up as I had originally envisioned it. Um, I call it uh, Layers of Red. Um, I don't know whether you can truly see the red in here. Lanyard's red, red G10. I'll explain the resin. It's a pinkish color for now. And you can see a layer of G10 and the maroon or red phenolic in the middle. White ocularis plugs. Red skulls. Um, now the resin. This resin is actually something that Sarah gave me. Um... Uh, she she started mixing some resin. Um, for those who don't know, this is actually um, what would normally be used is with fiberglass. They call it fiberglass resin. Um, it has a very distinct smell. Um, I, after you've dealt with resin a long time in your life, like I have, and quite frankly, from the time I was a kid, I was around resins and all that, especially fiberglass resin. You learn the smell of it real quick. Now, the thing about uh, fiberglass resin is when it cures, it's got a slight amber hue to it, okay? That's just the way it is. It's always been that way. Um, and when you mix it with suspended white, um, whatever you want to call it, pearlescent or white powder, um, it almost goes a mild pink. It, you can still see the amber in it a little bit, but also you can see hints of pink. And more importantly, it does interesting things. Now you can see right here where there's clear resin. Um, because of the density of this resin, some of the suspended, if it doesn't cure fast enough, like when you do thicker slabs, the suspended stuff raises to the top or sinks to the bottom. It does weird things. Um, and you get, like you see, clear resin in the middle. And that's actually more the color of what this resin really is before you add the pearlescent. And it kind of has a cool effect. If you look at it, it almost looks like there's a hidden world in between. But anyway, finish this one up. Hope you guys like it.